Welcome to Scorn. This is a horror adventure game by Ebb Software. I watched somebody play it for just a little bit some months ago, playing a preview of it, and it looked disgustingly beautiful and just overall odd and fascinating. I took a quick peek at how it's doing in reviews now that it's fully released, and it seems like it's not reviewing all that well. Uh, people generally seem to be complaining about it being a bit short and feeling kind of aimless or pointless. I tend to like games that are on the stranger side and the more experimental side, so I still really want to give it a try. So let's go. New game. I'm going to overwrite my current game. I played it for all of like one minute just to make sure that the settings seem okay and, you know, everything works. So I haven't really played it at all. Okay, so at the very beginning when we regained consciousness, it looked like we had a lot of changes to our body, like there was a whole device thing on our hand, and we just looked a lot more modified compared to how we look now. You can see our hands don't have that thing in it. So I think this is kind of in the past now, how we got to that point of being like stuck into... I don't know, the flesh of something. I think this is how we got there. We fell from all the way up there while crawling towards some tower thing. Anyway, when I played for all of one minute, I did take a look down, and we seem to be missing quite a bit of our skin. So that's, uh... Yeah, I don't know how I'm alive, really. The aesthetic is just wild. It's disgusting and beautiful. I think I meant to do something with that once I have something, but I don't have anything right now. Just the forms on the walls, everything, just how it looks, the shapes are just... I don't even know how to describe them. And it's so quiet, I feel like I should whisper. Such a pretty game. In a, you know, disturbing, disgusting way. It's this grime just hanging off of everything here. So that has one, like, orb lit up. That probably means something. I don't like that claw 
hand thing. Oh, the ground's different here. I think some reviews complained about it being a walking simulator, but that is exactly the sort of thing I love. So for me, that's a feature. Watch out that you don't bump your chest cavity. Is it the hand thing we saw later on? Mm. I don't think that... Maybe that was what we had later on. I feel like it maybe looks a little different. God, that's really just in our body now, huh? Blood all over our hands even from it. that can open doors? It's like the wall is rotted through in places. What is this wall made out of? It almost looks vegetal, like there's vines or something in the areas where it's kind of rotted away. Maybe that's the bones of the wall or something. I guess our hand goes in there. What? what those controls are in the bottom right like the use it's a circle oh i guess it's just the icon that icon means use exit is <laughs> i don't know <laughs> oh exit's right click you have to hold it down for a certain amount of time i see yeah, it's really just kind of throw you into this world and you just got to figure things out, even the controls for the most part. Okay, so right click, hold to exit. Left click to use, I guess. Wait. Oh, that's changing my currently selected, like, node. So we unlock that one. Oh, okay. We like undid a latch and then we operated a gear after we unlatched it. I see. Yeah. Okay, it doesn't stay open for long. I guess there's no going back. Bye. 
It looks almost like a throne. These look kind of like train tracks. These look like ribs. <laughs> Just trying to understand what I'm even looking at. That's pulsing disturbingly. And that... I don't know, kind of looks like stalactites and stalagmites. Like... Stone that is formed from, you know, deposits over thousands and thousands of years. It's got that drippy, melty kind of deposit formation look. Oh. Okay, it's another control thing. This one's different from the last one, though. The last one had a glove. This, uh, These aren't gloves. <laughs> oh my god. So what did that do, practically speaking? Did it just raise that up? Out of the way? Was it in the way before? That looks weirdly like a cross between some sort of heavy machinery and scorpion stingers. How, how does this work? At the moment, I don't think it does. Is this like a train cart? Is this thing going to run on the tracks? Looks like a really fucked up toilet bowl. Okay, this one has a glove. That means same as before controllable nodes. Okay. It can be set in two positions. That's me trying to use it in the bottom position. Let me move it up and then try to use it. Okay, don't think we're meant to use this just yet. I think something else needs to be done first. Oh, what's at the top here? Oh, this is fascinating. I love this so far. What? Yeah, I can see myself there, moving. Okay, three notes to select. Let's use one. Oh, this controls the track. Well, I don't know exactly where we're trying to go from or to. I think I've just made a just a complete loop, <laughs> which probably isn't useful. But for now, I'm going to leave it there because I don't know where we're trying to go. Okay, let's see where all these pathways go. I think we came from here. Yeah, that's the closed door. Let's go down this train track. Ah, 
I'm a little bit worried about finding creatures that are going to try to kill me because I know this game has weapons. I know that there's some sort of combat. Is this? Oh, it's an elevator. These walls look metal. That's such a strange mix of biological things, metal things, vegetal things. Like, I don't know what these materials materials are. More, more train tracks. Like, what's the purpose of this place? Oh my god. What is this? Why is there no one here? What the hell are these? I tried to grab something that doesn't exist there. We, uh, what happens if we do it again? Alright, just that again. Too early to be doing anything with that. This, I think these are the things that it needs to grab. Yeah, these things. Like, these are empty ones. These are filled ones. Filled with God knows what. They seem like they were once alive. I don't know. But I probably need to, like, move this cart into place somehow. So it can grab one of them. Can I open doors now? No, I still can't. Can't just like push it with my body weight or anything. God, this is so vast. I feel like I'm getting lost in a maze and I have no idea what I'm even looking for. I'm at least thankful I can't open the doors. That at least limits my area of, of interaction a little bit. And we're back to the beginning. Yeah, let's go back down. God, the things in that look like tendons, I think. Right. Came from there. What are you? Another like heavy machinery looking tool, but it's just all wrong. Some endless pit. What is it? Scoop these up and drop them in there? Can we make it scoop? 
I don't know why we'd want it to scoop. But why not? Yeah, this, this is a factory. This is some sort of a factory. Pick one of these up? Perhaps? What? Let's move it back to the other position. Use it. No, there's nothing there. Maybe this one first? No, there's nothing there. Oh my god. People. It's our sacks filled with people. Am I missing some interaction here? Shouldn't something do do something? I'm not sure. Let's move on. I just keep sticking my hands in weird things trying to see if I can get something to happen. Okay, that like unlocked some things. Only while I use it though. Okay, this is a different mechanism that uses my... Oh. Okay, the door was stuck because it needs to be unlocked. Wait, can I... Can I somehow... Keep it unlocked? How would I do that? Because it seems like as soon as I leave this thing, it goes back. Yeah, it's already locked itself again. Okay, I'm definitely still missing something. Like a, some sort of a tool or, or power or something, I think. These? These look almost like oil pumps. Or whatever they're called. You know, the things. Okay, that's a pile of people. Oh. I guess it's pretty clear what that was for. Maybe some of these things aren't even meant to be used. Like, just because I can use them, I guess, doesn't necessarily mean I need them to solve a puzzle. Maybe they're just... You know, the lost machinery in this forgotten or abandoned or destroyed factory. And I don't actually need the machines, but they tell me a little bit about how things worked here and what what the purpose of this place is. I suppose that's definitely possible. What do you do? Okay, another grabber. Nothing to grab there.
Yeah, it's for moving the bodies. Jesus. Everything's liquefied. Hey, wait a minute. What is... It's another one of those things. Can't use that one. Maybe it's just an extra one? In case you missed the first, or... I don't know. to the central room. Okay, I've managed to work out that I don't think I can do anything down below until I have a body. I need to do something with a body. Or <laughs> what I guess is a body. I need to do something with whatever this thing is going to grab and put down below. So whatever I need to do is up here. I need to get something from up here down there. Hold on, this might be it. I, I didn't realize that just next to this device that tries to grab the thing, there's this device. This is probably what I was missing. Okay. Oh, that's cool. You don't click to make it do the thing. You hold it down to have the claw stay gripped, holding them, holding it down and then releasing. So do I grab it and then move it? If you look in the bottom right, it shows you what directions I can move. I can only move right or down. Left. Oh, I can only move within open sections, I guess. I'm not sure. Hold on. Release it. Okay, it doesn't fall or anything. Okay, I can grab practically anyone I want. Can I grab something from the left? No, it's only on this side. Well, it tries to grab from up here, right? So can I just grab like this one and move it over? Wait, do I need a particular one? Some of these are empty. This one here, it's a double? can't even move that up there. This one here looks different from the others. And I can't move it any direction right now. Maybe this one's special and like intact more than the others? I love the slight like jitter this thing has when it stops. This feels like a real piece of bizarre machinery. Uh, yeah, so where can I go with this thing exactly? It can only go from like an empty slot to an empty slot, so it can't go here. There's nothing there. So it has to go through... Where? There? Or there? Oh, this is such a cool machine. That should do it. I hope I made the right pick. Yep. 
Yes. Ew. Ew. Uh. Yeah, that didn't work. There we go. It took a while. Quite a long while. <laughs> but I finally managed to get all these pieces past it. You have to get everything past the piece you want. Everything on the right side of it. Because it's two across vertical, you can see the way this fits. You need this entire area clear. There we go. That should do it. Whew. Come on. Yes! Oh my god, that's horrifying. Let's go meet them downstairs. Wait a minute, they're alive? Oh, Jesus. Jesus Christ. Oh my god. Oh! I gotta put them out of their misery. Okay, hold- mm, Hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to- I need to make sure I direct them to the right place. I can change how the tracks are laid out, of course. Right now. going over there. I think... Probably supposed to cut them open, right? Probably. Oh, God. Let me go change it so that it leads to the cutting station. I guess we have to do this step first. I don't even know what this thing does. Probably something horrible. Get ready. What did that just do? Oh god.
You know, I thought I was taking them to the cutting station. I actually accidentally took them to the wrong place, but maybe it's the right place? I don't know. Oh my god. At least they're out of their m misery. Did I actually accomplish anything? What the fuck am I gonna do with this? Jesus Christ. Oh my god, I can look down and see the fucking hand. Okay, do I stick that into the other? Th Ew, no, I hate it. I'm going to look up so I don't have to look at it. <laughs> or do I need that... Do I need that... To operate these at the same time? Can I do that? Don't I need... I think I need two hands. No, I, I don't think that's it. Mm. Yeah, is it? Is it this? I guess I needed the second one to do this. the blade thing? Was that just another way I could have accomplished the same thing? Jesus Christ. Success! Doesn't feel very good. So do they grow humans or whatever those creatures were and then they harvest them and use them for something obviously they don't give a shit whether they stay alive or not given how crudely it just shucked them out of the shell killing them in the process and cutting off a limb are they just raw biomass Can't use that. That might be a blessing.
There's strange sounds coming from this thing. They're very quiet, but I can hear them. this around what is it did something. That worked and opened the way. Uh, or not. I think I need out the other one. I think I need out that one. Oh my god, that scared me. I guess I found what I was missing. What is this? Oh, that looks like a gun. Ish. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, put that back on. I don't I don't want to see that. Ugh. be aimed. Should I fire it? Does it have limited ammo? It seems to be like a... I'm not sure what to call it. I'm not sure if it's meant as a weapon or a tool. It's like a percussion device or a grabber. What do I do with this thing? What do I need to hit or grab? Seems to regenerate over time. Yeah. Wait, is it used to operate these? Power things. What about these things floating all around, though? Are they safe? Because, I mean, it, this works as a, a essentially a key, I guess, but then it can also be used like a weapon, it seems like. 
Are you an enemy? They don't seem to notice me. Oh my god! Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Is it like... Did I touch the steam? Or whatever that is? Oh my god. What a weird weapon! Yeah, I don't think they're trying to hurt me, but... Their steam just happens to hurt me. It's almost like they're trying to... Sanitize or something, you know? Oh, what a weird weapon. Like, it feels like it's not even meant to be a weapon. Like, I'm just using a tool as a weapon, improvised, and it feels so clunky and, oh, it feels... Uh, something just amazing about how it feels. Not that it feels good, per se, just... I don't know. Okay, we, um, yeah, we have another one of those power things over here now? Yeah. use this tool in another area on the opposite side. This place seems symmetrical. Don't use that. Ah, oh, right. I forgot you had to do that first. 